Yo everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing another Primark haul. What's new? Yesterday I went to Primark in Westfield Shepherd's Bush, which as you guys know is my local Westfield. And it also, for those of you that didn't know this, did you know that Westfield Shepherd's Bush is now the biggest shopping centre in Europe? How lucky am I? It's on my doorstep. Anyway, so went into Primark, picked up a couple of things, checked out what new stuff they had, and I just wanted to share it with you guys. So the first thing I got that may or may not be of interest to you guys, for me as a YouTuber, a makeup YouTuber, that's why I was drawn to this. It's a mirror, and as you can see, it kind of bends in different directions, so I can kind of sit it up here in front of me like this. I can sit it down here when I'm doing makeup tutorials. It's a really great little travel thing. It bends in all different directions. You can hang it off of something like this. And it costs £3.50, which is excellent. So I'm really glad that I got this. They have recently expanded their storage collection. Now, I know that you guys have for ages been asking me to do a makeup storage, makeup collection kind of video now. For those of you that have not seen in my previous video, my house is on the market. I'm moving at some point over the next, whenever somebody decides to finally put in the correct offer on our house, cheap passes. And um, a lot of my makeup is in storage, etc., which is difficult for me. But then also in terms of doing a proper video for you guys, I can't really do that. But I did think that when I eventually do move into my new house, brand new, clear room, clear area, I can really kind of spread out and do a proper makeup storage video for you guys. Now, I picked up this. It's still in its plastic. As you can see, there's two large compartments here. One long one here and lots of little ones where you can put lipsticks, little knick-knacky sort of things. This costs £5. They've got loads of different variations of this. This fits into a classic ikea alex draw the perfect width and length it leaves a little bit of space on the side for any extras and they've got loads of other stuff they've got um a lot of dupes of muji's drawers i've got, actually got muji drawers myself and loads of other different things so for those of you that may have i mean my makeup storage is already quite set and a lot of this stuff obviously wasn't available when i did start setting up my makeup storage but for those of you that are still quite new to the game and are at the moment kind of spilling all over the place definitely look into Primark's makeup storage because it's very affordable as well also picked up this double pack of deep clean deep cleansing wipes it comes in 25 wipes in a pack i don't know how much it is probably one pound fifty or something it doesn't have the price on it i picked up these earrings which it says is part of their autumn winter 18 they're three pounds so you can see they've got gems on one side and on the other side i also got these earrings from their halloween section here's the thing i love halloween hey um but i don't actually dress up for halloween but throughout the month of october i generally wear like halloweeny related stuff so i saw these spider earrings which are long and dangly and i've got gems on where the face is and the body of the spider is as well and i also got this set of stud earrings it costs two pounds and it's got all these Halloween-y sort of things. There's one missing because I'm wearing it at the moment. I don't know if you can see. It says boo. Boo. Are you scared? So I got these which I'll probably wear throughout the month of October for fun. Because I've got another piercing back here. So I tend to wear small studs on my second hole. I also picked up these which are amazing. They cost £1 each. It's 20 makeup brush covers. So as you can see they are amazing. Just how you get when you get a brand new brush sent to you. And if you can see here, they come in a variety of different sizes as well. So that means you've got something for your large powder brushes, your foundation brushes, your tiny eyeshadow brushes. And that's the reason why I bought two of them. They were one pound each and you get 20. So now when you wash your makeup brushes and they're drying, you can put these in them to retain the shape so that they stay nice and tapered and don't go all over the place. Now this is nothing new by any means, but for God's sake, Primark, sort out your foundations. Every time I go there, there's like a hundred of these in the whitest shade and that's it. This one I actually think may have been opened. There was a sticker over it and I look, kind of looked at it. I was like, mm, shook it, opened it myself, saw it was full, but I swear somebody used it. But anyway, so this is the My Perfect Color Velvet Finish Foundation and my shade is in Toffee and it is a medium to full coverage uh, foundation. It costs £6, which is a little bit more pricier, I think, than their other ones. Comes in a glass bottle. I'm actually wearing this today. I've been after this for a long time. Every time, no matter what Primark I go to, there's either 100 shades of the fairest one, one deep shade. Everybody seems to be my shade. What? How's that? 
that, that's nonsense it's just Primark with their poor keeping up with their stock but this one if you can get your hands on it is an excellent foundation I also picked up their My Perfect Colour Mineral Powder. It's a medium coverage oil-free loose powder in the shade Toffee again. And it costs £2. I actually used it stupidly to set this foundation. don't know if you can tell I look a little bit tanned. This Toffee appears to be a little bit darker than this Toffee. And plus, because this has got coverage in it, it gave me a bit more colour than I actually needed. So I think next time I will remember, if I'm wearing quite a sheer foundation, then I can apply this on top. Not when you're already wearing a medium to full coverage one, but I'm sure you guys think I look alright. But yeah, just thought I'd let you know. They also duped, no surprise there, Primark, copying everyone, these two Radiant Beam Jelly Highlighters. Now, these are supposedly dupes for the Farsali Jelly Highlighter. Now, I do have to say, I am wearing one of them today. I'm wearing the shade Gold Rose Beam. You can see it here. I think the Farsali one might be better. Now, I have to say, I don't own the Farsali one, but I, when I was in America earlier on in the year and I was in Sephora and I was playing around with it, so I can say the difference and whatever. I will do a review on these probably tomorrow. I just wanted to have the chance to actually try it on today so that I can do a proper review comparison with the Farsali one. So they come in two shades, Rose Beam and Golden Beam. I'm not going to open it. Well, I'm not going to open it now because it does get messy and I will make a big mess here and then just be really annoyed with myself. So these cost £4 each and then they also released some of their new super matte liquid lipsticks. These ones are really great. I love their liquid lipsticks. I've got another three in my room which are from previous seasons but this shade here is called cookie dough and this one is called dare to bear they're both different types of browns i've not actually as you can see opened them but again they've released these kind of shades for the autumn winter sort of season and that's it the rest of my bag is empty hope you guys enjoyed the video like comment make sure you subscribe and i'll see you all soon